Good morning, guys, on this Sunday morning. How's everybody doing today? Oh, it's cold out here. I'm getting ready to go to church this morning. So I've got my little hat on, my black hat. And let me see if I can show you the rest of my outfit. I don't have my shoes on yet. I have this pretty uh, blouse here, black and two color tone pink and white blouse. And um, let me show you my pants. Just some black slacks and I'm waiting for Aaron to get his slow self ready. <laughs> Drinking on my coffee here, my little sweater mug. You guys like this mug? I got it at, um, uh, what store was this? Uh, TJ Maxx. And I got it with my gift card that Saving with Miss V gave me. So, But church is over, guys. We just got out. And now we're here at Subway so Aaron can get him a Subway sandwich. I'm not going to get one. But you know what? When I do get them, I get the ones with veggie, a veggie uh, Subway. It's just the bread and veggies only. Okay, I'm gonna nothing use that in there. Real quick. Nothing in there but vegetables. So that's what I'll, you know, I'll get that for myself. Sometimes, you know, I'll not splurge, but just treat myself. And it's just vegetables in there and a little bread. So I was on my way to the mall with my mother. She's going to buy me something, but. There's been a change of plan, so um, she's not able to go today. So she said, well, you can go on your own. So I don't know if I'm going to go today or not. I kind of want to go, and then part of me just doesn't feel like just going in. Because I want to get home and get these church clothes off. Because I have on some heels. I'm I just don't feel like going. <laughs> I don't want to go. And I gotta take Aaron to go buy his dad a Christmas gift. That's what we do. My husband would take him to buy me and other family a gift if, you know, as long as he has the money. And now it's my time, my turn to take him today to get a gift for his dad. So I'm gonna do that, but I'm gonna stop by my mother's house briefly and give her something um oh i wanted to tell you guys i am so happy i just love my husband because that movie a christmas blessing that i told you guys about that i love and i want to see he found it on one of our tv um channels our network channels i was like what you found that movie so it's scheduled to go um uh, it's scheduled to come on today which is sunday at four o'clock so i'm so so excited I cannot wait and I'm gonna keep that recording on my on my TV until I decide to delete it hello okay he's eating a delicious looking sandwich what kind of sandwich is that show the sandwich it's a turkey sandwich with uh, turkey all right guys we made it to the store here and Aaron is in there shopping, so I decided to just stay in the car. Uh, it is cold outside. It's cold outside, baby. I'm just going to sit here and just chit-chat with you guys for a moment. We had a good service today at church. I haven't had my main meal, but I had some pistachio nuts, just a little bit in here, and I ate those but I feel like I need something something a little bit more with some substance <laughs> at least some type of a salad but you know guys I don't know if you guys are aware about this romaine lettuce it's um, supposed to be um, on recall because of some E. coli um, if the lettuce comes from a place called Salinas California um then it's tainted with e coli or something so um we have not had lettuce salads of any kind ever since what two or three weeks ago ever since they announced it on the news 
So I, I miss my lettuce. You know, I don't like spinach in my salad. Mix, if it's mixed in a little bit, you know, a few little leaves along with the romaine, I like it mixed up like that. But anywho, um, I'm not eating the lettuce until they say the lettuce is okay to eat. But some of the stores, hmm, I don't know why my lens, hope my lenses are not blurry because I had Aaron to kind of cl clean it up for me a little bit. So I hope you guys are not seeing this on a blurred lens. If so, I'm sorry. <laughs> and some of the stores are selling them. They still are carrying the lettuce in the store. And I'm like, why? When they say things, something's wrong with the food, honey, I'm going to leave it alone until I hear otherwise. Because <laughs> I just don't like taking chances. Sundays, sometimes I don't like to cook on Sundays. So, hubby said we can go get something out to eat. Now, i got to be selective. What am I going to eat? Um, we're not going to a restaurant. We're just going to pick up something from, you know, one of these fast food places. But I don't really eat fast food. So here I go again. I've got to be very selective about what am I going to get. And it's just a bummer that I can't get a salad. Because I love that place called Soup Plantation. I love that place because you can get your salad, you know, um, make it any way you want they sell soup and stuff like that but i don't want any soup i had some soup yesterday so I, i'm all souped out and um yeah i don't know what i'm gonna get i may have to go to panda express and because sometimes i would get their chow mein which is not even chow mein they say it's chow mein it's those um noodle type things but it doesn't taste like chow mein. It's not the real, authentic chow mein. And I asked one of the employees there one time, I said, excuse me, this is not chow mein, is it? And she looked at me with kind of like a little smile, and she said, like, hesitantly, yes, it is. I'm thinking, no, it's not. That's not chow mein. I've been to those real, authentic Chinese food places, those restaurants where you get the real um, chow mein. And I know the difference. So they're just trying to pass off those noodles as <laughs> chow mein. They're not fooling me. Oh, I wanted to tell you guys, as of yesterday, Saturday, I have finally completely finished decorating for Christmas. Woo! Man, man, man. I tell you, I think I'm gonna start next year decorating earlier now I don't know how earlier but it's gonna be sometime in November because it's just like one of the youtubers said here uh, in one of her videos she said that you know watching other people um, they have their houses all decorated they can sit back and relax and enjoy everything <laughs> and here we are the latecomers even though when I started decorating it wasn't technically late I don't start late. I normally start the first week in December. So that's not really late, but I guess it seems like it's late because of most people that they start early. But she said she was going to start early next year too because you want to sit back and relax. You don't want to be halfway in the month and you're still decorating. And that's kind of how it is because yesterday I still consider that half of the month already gone so I finally finished and I'm like I'm not gonna even have time to really enjoy it just for these last couple of weeks because on January 1st you guys know I take all my stuff down I'm not gonna keep it up past January 1st no way I don't do that so ah, uh, got to start earlier next year yeah but I'm just glad to be finished. You just don't know. That was a lot of work. And it's not like I have a big mansion or anything. I have a one-story home. Three bedrooms. And I'm not even... Oh, that's a cute little dog he's putting in his car. I'm not even decorating the entire house. Not the bedrooms. Just pretty much 
the living room, the um, entryway, kitchen and dining area. That's it. And you would think you could do that in one day, but honey, it has taken me practically almost this whole month <laughs> just to do that. I tell you, because, you know, decorating is art. You can't just do it like this. It takes time. You have to think, first of all, do you have a theme that you want to go with? A color palette? You got to figure out what you want to do. Then you got to go shop for it if you don't have the things already on hand. And for the most part, I had, um, I use almost, not everything, but almost everything of my decor that I already have. But I did buy some new things because I want a different look. I have a lot of decor that's considered, um, I would consider it this way. It, it's not really, it's like cute, cute decor. And I don't like that. I, I'm trying to branch out because I want things that are considered beautiful pieces. Beautiful, um, not that they have to be expensive, but just beautiful and good quality. You know, Hobby Lobby, they still have their Christmas decor on sale for 50% off. And I I only bought a couple of things from there. I think some lights to go outside on my wreath. And those lights were 50% off, but do you know they're not working anymore? <laughs> I was like, man. Mm, mm, mm. I said to myself, you know, those string lights. Those lights just, you know, I don't even know if I want to buy any more string lights. Because every time you get something like that, they work for a few days, maybe a week, and then after that they stop working. These don't have batteries in it. You don't you don't put batteries in it. You just push a button. You pull out this little tab. It's like a little tab that's attached to the the handle. You pull it out, then you push the button. It's supposed to come on. Well, I should have known better. <laughs> but I just thought, well, you know Hobby Lobby. You know Hobby Lobby has good things, yeah. Mm, who told you that lie? But anyway, no, I'm just kidding. They do have some nice beautiful things but those lights have got to go so i'm disappointed about that and i told my husband i said no i'm not buying any more lights forget it the wreath just will not be lit up <laughs> the weather here is cold and i don't have my jacket on and when i went over to my mother's house she said where is your wrap where is your socks <laughs> and i said okay it's time to go now and that was my way of escaping from hearing all that but she's right she's right but i was like yeah i know mommy but anyway guys aaron is on his way back to the car so i'll catch you guys later About to go out and get our food because I need to eat because I've got a headache now and I don't know why it's just one of those things but I'm gonna turn on these lights try not to let you guys see the Christmas tree so turn on the Christmas lights okay the Christmas tree is lit actually it's not dark enough to light up everything else so let me go over here yeah i had to change out of that blouse i had on it is so cold outside you guys omg i mean i came in here and turned on the heater because i couldn't take it i use a spoon when i'm trying to um close the top oh, shutters and my hubby's not around but he's around now yeah, <laughs> Thank you. You were. You were. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. oh, sweet kiss. <laughs> All right, guys, we're gonna go get our food right now. I see a brighter light. Yeah, I think this. I think it's the lighting from the camera. I think so, as well as well. There's no sun behind the cell. 
Okay guys, we got our food, so thanks for watching!